Hello guys, welcome to the channel. Today I've gave myself a challenge to make a beat with all free samples, software instruments and plugins. This is what I come up with. Let's have a listen to a section of the sound and I'll show you guys what I've used on each sound. So as you can hear, that's what I've come up with. First one is uh, this kick drum is from Drum Pro, which is a free drum kit. You basically get a couple of free drum kits, then you have to buy the rest. But this is the free version. The second kick is ultra beat, but basically this is a kick sample from the Slate Digital Pack that was recently gave out for free. That's the kick there. I basically dropped in uh, ultra beat. The next one is snare, which is the same. I've dropped the Slate Digital Sample Pack. The clap, the same. The clap has come from the same Drum Pro. As you can see there, that's the hip hop. But if you see all these other instruments, I've got a bit of tweaking to them. Like the kick, you've got Logic. Tech EQ, which is the vintage tube EQ. I've also done some filtering and boost just to shape the sound to fit with the bass that I've got here. The same hi hat, same thing is hi hat of the slit pack. The bass has come from Alchemy, which is basically a software instrument that comes with logic. I've got this first bass, deep sub bass, and the second bass, heavy bass. They've both come from Alchemy, which is in Logic Pro. So that's software instrument you get free with Logic Pro. Listen to the two of them played together. The next guitar is from DSK Dynamic Guitar. I've used the nylon string. Kalimba is from Alchemy on the mallets. The bell is from Alchemy as well. These two chords, they are from Alchemy bass echo chord. As you can hear how that sounds, I've basically added some filters. I wrote off the top and the bottom, and then I used the new vinyl from Isotope. So if I play the sound without the vinyl or without the EQ, this is what it sounds like. But I've rolled up the top because this is trap beat, so I want it to be a bit dark and Now with the vinyl. As you can feel, there's some scratch going on there, which actually helps it cut through as well in a dance mix, because I've turned them down and pan it to the right. And while I pan this one to the left, just to give me wheat. Then the rest is just a few riffs and drops here and there. That's still off the slate digital pack. All the risers and the drops that you hear in between sounds here and there. Let's take a look at this drop. So there you have it on the mix boss. I've also stick to all three plugins as you can see. I've used linear face EQ from Logic and I've also used Tan, which is my favorite boss compress. On this occasion, I'm using it as mid side. I'm using it to compress the mid so that all the kick drums and hi-hats will just sit right tight in the middle while the side floats. I'll bypass this so you can hear it in and out. <laughs> So 
So if you basically listen to the kick when I put this in, because it's in that middle that I really wanted to hold on to that kick properly, because as you can see, I've layered two kicks. And not only have I layered two kicks, I've also done a parallel compression here, which where I bust the kick to a subgroup. And on that subgroup, I've added the free monster. This L2 here, obviously it's not free one, but that can go. It's not doing anything really. You can use any limiter. It's just so that it doesn't overshoot. So any limiter can actually do the job there. Something like this. That will still do the job. Like on the base, I've used the TDR just to help hold it in place. As well as this head crusher just to distort it properly. Let's have a quick listen to the base without all this. As you can hear that helps it to cut through the mix especially the head crusher which is also a free saturation or should i say distortion plugin so there you go because this is all done with all free sounds and all free plugins i'm gonna give it for free whoever has got lyrics to this beat just hit me up and uh, i'll send you that to put your voice in thanks for watching don't forget to like and subscribe and i'll see you on the next video